Hi guys, so today I'm opening my Fad Fit Fun box for the fall. Um, this I paid for myself, so it is not sponsored or gifted or anything. Um, but before I get into the video, I want to thank Vush for sponsoring um, this video. Um, I've been working with them for a while now and we're working on a collaboration and I'm just so honored to be working with them. Um, they are a self-love and sexual wellness brand that sells vibrators so that you can um, self-pleasure or pleasure with a partner. Um, and I've talked about them before. Um, the vibrator that I'm really loving is in the first video I talked about with them. I also posted a um, picture with it on Instagram and I have a 20% off code if you want to try one of their products which I would highly recommend um, so that will be on the screen now and in the description box below if you want to check them out which I would totally recommend you doing you guys know I would never work with a brand that I didn't fully believe in and um, I just love that they're trying to break the stigma around um, sexual wellness and especially women's pleasure so let's get into opening the fall box I did pick all my items because I do have the annual membership but I barely remember what they were. Um, I actually picked my items and then I watched someone else unbox there, someone who is sponsored, um, and she's like super honest and stuff, and she tried a product, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna switch some of my stuff. So one of the things I'm very excited about, I already do remember, um, but so let's open this sucker up. I do love that the boxes are like real cardboard now, so they're easier to be recycled. I have cats here, so they're gonna love this with the box. Okay, so we have our little magazine. We have $15 off your first box, which I don't know why I would get this since I already get the box, I don't know. Okay, so lots of um, this, it's all recyclable though, so that's great. Okay, we got a lot of little papers for discounts and stuff. Okay. First thing we'll just grab is the Shea and Moringa Balm. It's a moisturizing balm for hands and body. And I think I picked this because I'm not allergic to any of the ingredients because the ingredient, the only ingredient is some kind of butter and Moringa seed oil, which is great because usually this kind of stuff has beeswax in it. So let's just try this right now. i to take off the little um, tin thingamajigger. Come on. It's obviously thick. <laughs> Come on. Why won't it come out? Did I like leave some of the plastic on there or something? No, it's just, it's really thick. It's like a butter, like a straight up like squeezing butter through this tiny little hole. But I like thick creams a lot, so let's see. It's nice, it doesn't feel greasy or sticky, it just feels really thick. I actually like that, so not complaining. There's really, there's a minor smell, but nothing like noticeable. Okay, this is the one I went back and switched for. This is from, the brand um, Tracy Ellis Ross's brand from Blackish. Um, it's a new hair care brand for curly hair, and I have a um, perm that's falling already. Um, but I'm excited. This is a curl gel, and I don't usually use gel, um, but I love this packaging. I think it's so pretty. It feels like so nice, um, and I don't think I'm allergic to any of the ingredients. And I'm pretty sure the person who I saw talk about this really liked this, so let me smell it. It also has the packaging sealed, which I appreciate. Okay. It smells nice. It smells very clean. Okay, so we're not going to obviously try that right this second, but wonderful. Garbage. Okay. Get out of here, mister. Then we have an eye cream, I think, right? Yeah, co complete eye renewal balm, which I'm really excited about because my under eyes have been super dry and the last two eye creams I used made me itch. So this is from Algenist. It's formulated with algoronic acid, whatever that is, um, but it's for anti-wrinkle. I really am looking for more um, hydration. It says, within four weeks of use, most people saw eye contour visibly smooth, puffiness appeared decreased, and dark circles were visibly decreased too. So, we'll be trying this. I'm excited. It looks like a really decent size, too. Yeah, that's a nice size. Okay, so. And I checked all the ingredients before I ordered, so, like, I would make sure I wasn't allergic to anything. Okay, now what's this? There's something in here. And I don't know what it is. Chicken? Heineken. Alcohol free. 
not sure why I got this. An alcohol-free Heineken can. I mean, if I was gonna drink a beer, it would be an alcohol-free one because I don't drink alcohol, but like, I don't really know why they said that to me. Stop chewing on that, mister, stop it. Yeah. Okay, so, oh, there's more stuff over here. I feel like I got some free samples. Um, okay, what's this? A wine gift card thing. A little Dove spray deodorant. Don't use that, but some, I can give that to someone. This one I think I picked out. This is the LMS Papaya Enzyme Peel. Um, I don't know if I react well to papaya, but when this was the option to pick, like the things that were on there, like none of them sounded good to me. So it says it's to exfoliate and purify tired, lackluster skin. Non-abrasive fruit enzymes work to leave skin soft, revitalized, and radiant. So we will be trying that. And then we have two things that look very exciting. These are the things I was probably most excited about um, because I'm moving in about eight months. So. Okay, here's one. It's a frying pan. Uh, it's an eight inch frying pan non-stick. Um, we'll wash it early before you, so I'll probably just save it for when I move out, but let's just look at it, because it's supposed to be blue, I think. It has an er ergonomic steak tool handle. Works for all cook cooktops, dishwasher safe. Ooh, it's pretty. <gasps> it's so tiny, but it's cute. Oh, I love it. It's nice and lightweight too. Okay, so that's exciting. I'll probably just keep that in the box until I'm ready to use it when I move out. And then we got another thing that I was excited for when I move out too. Um, I think it's like a cheese board or something. Let me get it out of here. It comes in this box. It is, it's a cheese board. Let's open this. And that was the last thing. So this box, I think it didn't have that much in it, but I think it is usually five items. So, okay. I feel like, no. From what I've experienced so far from FabFitFun, I don't think that I would buy it again for the year. Like, I don't think I'm gonna renew because I just don't think that the price is worth it, to be honest. Like, most of this stuff I don't love. Like, every month I get like one or two things that I really like, and I just don't think it's really worth the full price, to be honest. Um, and that's why I like the person who I watch. It's Jen Loves Reviews. She like is super honest and is like, it's not worth it this month for me. So like, yeah. I don't regret it, but part of me is like, you know, I just didn't, I don't know. I just feel like I could have had this money and I wouldn't have missed any of these things. So this is super cute cheese board. Um, I guess you could also probably use it as a cutting board. I really like the wood um, and it's really like heavy duty, like serious, legit. Um, quality so those two things will be saved for once i move out so those are the two things i'm probably most excited about i am kind of excited about this but at the same time like it's a gel so i don't know how it's gonna work um i think that when the when i watched jen do it she like thought it was better on like damp hair or something it does have some ingredients i'm not a big fan of like citronelle limonene little um, lots of fragrances and stuff, lots of coconut ingredients, which isn't bad, but sometimes it can make me break out if they're too heavy. Um, so we'll see. It says it's best for like slucking your looks, so I don't know if it's really supposed to... This is a dream for divine, bouncy, juicy curls. I don't know. Maybe I should use a little. Come on. Well, it looks more like a cream than a gel. Last time I used a gel, I was like middle school let's just scrunch it up like this how i would with a curl cream this smells very cucumbery not a huge fan i just want to see if it's going to feel crunchy it definitely leaves like a a feeling on your hands i don't know how much that really did i mean the smell is really nice but other than that i'm like not loving it so much I don't know it's just kind of like I don't think that did anything maybe I didn't use enough I don't know but I might get I have a friend who might want this if I end up not liking it but um yeah and then I have the eye cream and the hand cream but to be honest like for this like I would spend four dollars for this at like the drugstore so I don't know if this brand's like super good or something and I do like moringa I know that's a good ingredient um I'm not gonna go through all the stuff you could get you know because that's what people who sponsor they're sponsored by the brand too um that's just the stuff i picked 
the Heineken thing, super duper weird. <laughs> the enzyme peel, I will keep you posted on, and this I will give to someone else. I do feel like I'm missing something though, but I'm probably not. I'm just feeling disappointed because I spent money on this. Okay, so that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you again to Bush for sponsoring, and I will see you next time. Let's say bye to your baby. Say bye. Say bye.